Hey everybody, it's Hari Swaminathan from OptionTiger.com. We're looking at our swing trades here. Uh, if you look at the ES, yesterday was a very big day down, but today the futures are up about 15 points. So what we are going to do is look at our existing trades. Let me open this up. And uh, on Apple, as you can see, it's going to go up about $2.73. So we are recovering well. On um, uh, on Adobe, what we want to do is, uh, Adobe, we want to double down at this point because uh, it's uh, down uh, 15. So this is about 30% down. So what, I, uh, what I'm going to do is I want to double down. Uh, so I'll, I'll say, uh, uh, buy five orders, I mean five contracts, and it's going for about four point something at this point. So it would be a good uh, uh, place to double down on Adobe. I'm going to keep it at 430 and uh, send in this order. Now also let's look at some of the other positions. Baba is uh, also going to go up, which is good. We have our bull call edge over here. This is the bull call and this is the bear call behind it. The bear call behind it is uh, going to benefit as long as uh, Baba goes uh, straight into the bull call, which it already is at this point. Uh, Costco just mildly down, so we're going to leave it at that. And uh, Netflix also is the iron condor. And uh, once again, uh, we don't have to do anything here. And same, same with Visa. Now, as far as the market watch after yesterday's uh, after yesterday's price action, you can see a lot of the stocks that were in the very bullish have, uh, have you know, are not in bullish anymore. What I like is gold at this point. Uh, gold, as you can see, the Spider Gold Trust, it is in the very bullish. Gold is on fire, and gold. The advantage is that it will also act as a hedge against the overall market dec uh, decline. So what I mean is, if you look at the ES on a three-month basis. Uh, the ES is still yet to fully convincingly break through this all-time level. So as you can see, this uh, you know this is the level. Yes, it did poke its head over there, but this is not convincing enough. And since then, it's been sort of topping out and coming down. So we do need to uh, watch uh, the the balance of our trades. And therefore, what I'm thinking is uh, the best one would be gold at this point. And uh, gold is extremely bullish. And so we're going to look at GLD, which is the uh, gold ETF. And uh, gold, there is no risk of, uh, uh, you know, any earnings or anything like that. So I'm actually going to go uh, a little further than usual to say 51 days. And gold is at 134. So I'm going to pick uh, something around the 137 level, which is about a 35 delta. This is perfect. I'm going to put in this uh, order for gold. And uh, that would be the new trade uh, for today. So this is uh, it. A 137 call expiry is 16th August and uh, we'll, we'll get in somewhere here at around 190. So that's the new trade for today. Thank you very much.